Hello my friend, Mr. Horse here, at your service, as always. I do really uh, like to finish uh, the times they are changing, because I uh, did three videos already on the song. This is the fourth one. Criticize what you can understand. Your sons and your daughters are beyond your command, and your world is rapidly aging. Please get out of the new one if you can't lend your hand. All times they are changing. This is a very uh, important verse. You know, the reason I am doing this song, you know, I'm recording this song verse by verse, is because there's so much information, there's so much to talk about in the song, right? Now this song, not this song, this verse is about the conflict between school and home in the Western society. Because I, a friend of mine from college immigrated to the West and been teaching in public schools uh, for many, many years. And he told me that in America, teachers in the public schools, they don't just teach, they don't just teach, you know, math, history, you know, science, English, whatever, subjects. They also try to parent the kids, their students. So they're competing, you know, with, with the parents the, the, of the, their students in terms of teaching them things other than the academic content. Now that's a very interesting thing. I mean, we, that, 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 that's not the case in, in Taiwan or China or in the Eastern world. I mean, here in Taiwan, a math teacher, he teaches math, that's it. Or she, in the classroom, that's all, that's all he teaches. That's all he talks about, she talks about. Uh, a science teacher only teaches science. An English teacher in Taiwan only teaches English. I mean, that is the way it is, it should be. It's been this way for, you know, many years. Uh, since the beginning, really. So, our mothers and fathers throughout the land 
Don't criticize what you can understand. Don't criticize what you can understand. Now this is now. This is not what Bob Dylan opinion. I mean, that's not his idea. You know, he just wrote down what is going on in 2020. And then this, again, this song was written 56 years ago. And he was able to see what exactly is going to happen, you know, in 2020. Amazing, I mean, amazing ability. So, so he wrote down what the attitude of the public educational you know, institution in the West, in America particularly, has towards a, you know, child's education. Don't criticize. Don't, don't criticize what you can't understand. So parents, so this is what the school is telling parents. Don't come mothers and fathers around the land for America. Don't criticize what you, what you can understand. So, when they see, well, you know, just what's going on in America, when the parents see, hey, their child's body, you know, physical strength is weakened. Become, you know, they become very weak from, you know, from going to school. They see their mind confused uh, by the school, the teaching, you know, the, the math, the way they teach math is completely, well, you know, again, this is what I heard, uh, it's completely nonsensical. Okay, they don't stick to the traditional teaching method. You know, they, 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 they like to uh, create, you know, various ways of uh, teaching uh, the math, for example, in order to confuse people. So people can learn how to do math. So, you know, confuse uh, young people's mind. And also, when they see their child's uh, character is being corrupted you know corrupt and they don't understand of course but the thing is the school say we well, you are know, so they, they're asking the, 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 the schools you know why what why did this happen you know why did you weaken their body confuse their mind and and uh, corrupt their character or spirit the school t told them, Don't criticize what you can't understand. For your sons and your daughters are beyond your command. Your sons and your daughters are beyond your command. Well, that's what happened. That's why, that's why the parents were concerned, right? I mean, how come they all become delinquents? I mean, they are so terrible, the behavior, so disrespectful, spoiled, lazy, rotten, and stupid. <laughs> I mean, they can't do anything. They can't really, they can't do any math. They can't do any, you know, they don't know any facts about history, about anything. They become so stupid, ignorant, stupid, rotten, uh, confused, lost, and uh, incompetent. I mean, they really can't do anything right to these young people, you know. So, and they're beyond your command. They don't listen to you. Absolutely, you have no control over them. Whatever you say, they're gonna say, whatever you ask them to do, they'll do the opposite. They'll do the opposite. Okay, please, Listen to your teacher in school, in classroom. But they, they will do the opposite. They won't listen to the teachers. So, 
and then so signs and your daughters are beyond your command your old role is rapidly aging so they're telling you the school is telling you hey your old road your old-fashioned thinking you know old road is rapidly aging it's getting old it's getting broken I mean you need to get rid of it you know the, the traditional way of thinking it's not decent you know it's not good anymore you need to adopt and if you please get out of the new one please get out of the new one if you can land your hand for all the times and they are changing so if you can help if you can participate in building this new road which is the opposite of the old road then get out of get out of it don't interfere don't interfere with uh, the school the school trying to not only teach the academic subjects they're also trying to teach your child your children everything morality you know mm. how to vote <laughs> they didn't you know the teacher they, 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 they try to teach you you know child who to vote for in the future after they become you know 18 so how to uh, I mean all these different things right first every teacher teaches reading because kids can read you know I mean we don't do that here in Taiwan but Chinese teachers teach how to read Chinese the English teacher teach how to read English the math teacher don't teach reading okay but in America every teacher first teach reading because kids can read every teacher teach critical thinking every teacher teach you know uh, sexual orientation I guess every teacher teach uh, politics Every teacher teach how to vote, who to vote for. And then every teacher teach, you know, all kinds of things. Every teacher teach, you know, how to rebel against your parents or rebel against the you know, public authority. All the time, because what? Why? Times they are a changing. So that's that's what is going on in 2020 you know in the west in the western society uh, in terms of the conflict i mean this is huge conflict uh, between school and home and family you know uh, according to what i heard from my friend also from reading the newspaper you know i mean not newspaper internet news yeah this is a huge problem you know I mean, the school really, uh, uh, really try to take over parents' job, you know, uh, in terms of teaching kids how to behave, how to think, how to behave, how to think, how to feel, you know. I mean, basically, the, the values, teach them values. The school, they think they know better than, they know more than the parents. Why? Because the teachers, they study humanities. They study humanities. So of course they know how to be human. They know better than you know everybody else, you know, to to what a human being is, it should be like. So anyway, that's very different from Taiwan, from China. I mean we don't here the teachers don't try to, you know, overstep. Overstep. You know, they know their boundaries. I mean, they know who they are, they are what their role is in society. Anyway, see you later.